And we're back to this. <laughs> Hello everybody, it's me, and welcome back to another video. Now, in this video, we're gonna take a look at Servolin. But, I know you might be wondering, what the heck, you just did Servolin when Stampede was bugged. Yeah, but now Stampede got changed to now it's basically a really, 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 really freakishly powerful move, and we're gonna be taking a look at that today. Now, I don't know exactly if this is going to end up being better, but hey, it probably won't be because it's Servolin, but we're going to look at it anyway. And here I have Brawny, uh, very clumsy and nimble. I think this is a completely fine personality. You can also run very Brawny with boots, which I think would also work, but I honestly don't think boots is the best item on Servolin personally. I kind of like Simple Essence to do as much damage as possible. And then we have a bulk up Stampede, Mega Chomp, and Quick Pounce. Stampede is our strongest move, being a 120 base power move that has no drawback except for costing like your entire energy bar. And then Boast is amazing because then we can just get a plus one melee attack boost if we can switch in on something like, let's say, Venolin, right? Then we can hit them with a Stampede while the Tundralin comes in. So that's an option. Then we can also bulk up to increase our melee attack even further to break through some walls. Maybe stuff like uh, Obsidragon, you know? And then Quick Bounce, just so we can pick up some good KOs. And then Mega Chomp, just so we can hit uh, stuff pretty hard for coverage. And then the TPs are pretty simple. The 56 health is just left over. The 44 gets you to 250. The 200, 200, so we're as fast as possible and do as much damage as possible. But yeah. That is pretty much the set. I know it went by pretty quickly, but there's not a whole lot to say because it's Servalin. But hey, it has Stampede. So you know what? Let's just take a look at it. Now, I kind of swapped up a lot of my team. Freddy Fazbear! I kind of swapped up a lot of my team today. Uh, they have one resist, which if it's not terrifying, is going to deal um, a lot of damage. Uh, Fiskarna's the lead, so Waba is what I'm going to lead with. I could also go with uh, Hollow Bunch, which gets to throw a Life Drain, which to switch into that would be... Wow, if I Nova Blast turn one with Hollow Bunch, if they go with Fiskarnally, that's going to pop off. Uh, slightly worried about the Zulong if this Hollow Bunch play doesn't work out very well, but it should be fine. This doesn't outspeed it, though, and it's going to be scary. This isn't my... Uh, I didn't give it Final Ruse either, so maybe I don't bring this right now. I'll just like the Final Ruse. And then how I deal with the Eruptodon, I'm not really... Maybe I do just leave with this. No. Still going to go with the lead I wanted to. Uh, Eruptodon, I guess I just bring this because it is the only thing that I have that can possibly resist the health, health storm. Okay, I did make the right move here. So I feel like I can assume that he switches here because he doesn't want to stay in. Shoot, I forgot to give it Nova Blast back ever since the doubles battle video. Who palms on Hollow Bunch? I mean, you're going to live, but why would you do that? I, I I'm supposed to have Nova Blast right now. Just to, to throw that out there. This is supposed to have Nova Blast. But if I don't want to deal with this, I just switch into Simon. I actually technically could have gone Servolin lead, and that would have actually done um, wonders. This should do absolutely nothing to me. And I can pretty much assume they go your soul, right? That makes... Hi, kitty. Hi. Oh, my kitty wants food. Uh, I don't see them staying in right i'm gonna go for a luster because i feel like they switch no i i don't what is your plan here buddy do you hi kitty does he want me to driving force i can switch him out i'm fine with this i'm very confused on his ideas okay kitty is he going to your soul now no there's a shrimp post okay so i won Alright, kitty. Please don't scratch my new mouse pad. Please don't. Get down. Get over here. Over here. Don't touch my mouse pad, please. I literally just got this. If you scratch it, I will be very mad. Come on, down. 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 Okay, good girl. I'm sorry that I kept your food here. I literally just got this mouse pad, though, and if you scratched it, I am going to disown you and throw you away. I will actually be very mad if she scratched it. Because I literally just got it today. I don't see any scratches. Because she doesn't... If she scratched it... I'm going to be very mad. It's fine. But there's this way long. Uh, how do I want to deal with this? Go haul a bunch. Hmm. I need to prevent my kitty from jumping up on my desk until a little bit. 
I don't see any visible scratches. I'm gonna get a flashlight, hold on. Okay, yeah, I don't see anything. Sorry, I just literally just got this and I'd really rather it not immediately get scratched up by my kitty. Okay, uh, there's nothing. Good, 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 good. Alright, but the Zulong is in. I'm gonna palm. Ancient Roar. Okay. I want Servolan to do something. I need barbs up, though, but I can't get barbs up. I'm assuming they just go Yursel now, right? That'd be a little spooky, but it could happen. What is their obsession with going Fiskarna on Hollow Bunch? If they want me to do all of its health, I will. I don't get the reasoning of Fiskarna versus Hollow Bunch. I'd honestly much rather kill this thing right now. So I'm going to risk another life drain. Okay. Good, 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 good. We still have 252 range attack, so Hollow Bunch is still looking really, really powerful. Shrimp Post. Funnily enough, Parasitize won't even kill me. This won't even kill me. Mm, okay, that's fair. Hmm. Now, Shrimp Post is slow, right? It has 130 attack. Uh, do you think a stamp, a plus one stampede would kill a Brawny 200? Let's see, 200 Brawny Stampede with 120 power. There's a chance, but it doesn't have any melee defense investment. Or I can just go Rancidor and then throw in a Muck Blast, which he struggles to switch into. Unless he goes for what? What's the signature please? Shell Bash, I think. It's fine, though. I don't know why you're going Zulong here. Cerebrine because then I can get a quick pounce off, right? But I know the jet's the better option because I can just not have to deal with the Zulon anymore. Mm. Unless it's boots. Okay, it's not boots. We're good. We're good. I'm eating Lay's, by the way. Lay's chips because I haven't eaten anything today. It's a lie. I had a burrito. It was more of a soft taco, I guess. Mmm. Immediately getting rid of your item. I'm not gonna die to that. No more item for you. Yep. Alright. He just lost 20% of his damage, which is amazing. I'm gonna barb if I can, but he's just gonna shadow strip me. Right? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that makes sense. Okay. Mm. Right now, we're in a really good spot to win with uh, Sir Bolin. Well, Shrimp Post is gonna die. I wanna try to win with Sir Bolin, but I doubt it. Okay. What has Freddy Fazbear got up his sleeve now? That's a little bit what I was worried about. Actually, no, this is great. If I go Simon, sack it, because Simon has no more usage. Usage. I, um... This is actually great. This is totally fine. This is completely fine. Landslide should do nothing to me. Hmm. 
Well, he's just gonna kill me, right? So. All I gotta think about here is does Stampede kill an Eruptodon? Right? Plus one Stampede. Erupted on. Let's see. You know, it's not likely. Oh, wait, I'm Simple Essence. Simple Essence. Oh, it's an 81% chance to Oko. And Rancidor resists all of Erupted on's moves. Not Erupted on. Um, Yersel. Okay, so we should get a melee attack increase here. Okay. And we outspeed this because because we have the higher base speed, unless this thing is very nimble, which is a horrible idea. Stampede. This should always kill. Sheesh! Okay. Okay. Alright, well, we're gonna die anyway, so let's just stampede. He's gonna quick punch, so. We just get a really big hit off here before we end up exploding. Oh my god. Do I kill with Quick Pounce? Wait. No, I don't, right? Oh, that would have been hilarious. One layer of Barb and Yersel died to a Cerebellin. Sheesh, though. Do you see that damage? I mean, this thing goes out a lot, right? And that, you don't even get the th drawback of Raging Tackle, you know? That's crazy. And we can Spectral Burst here to take down Lyursal. A GG. I'm pretty sure that's GG. I think the Zulong died, right? I think it did. Right? Zulong's dead. Right? Zulong's dead. Okay. Zulong's dead. GG. Oh, boy. And here we go into the next battle. Now, this is another game where I Cerebellin's really good and um, Program Speed's a free lead. Um... This, so I don't immediately lose to the Colossus Traps, and I can live at least, hopefully, one hit. I, I decided to also grab my, um, the Final Ruse Soul Siphon Rancidor. Mm, I'm gonna bring this so we don't lose to the Metatoad. And then we bring Cerebellin, because Cerebellin does actually kind of pop off this game. Though I actually probably would rather, uh, Tyrex here. I mean, my problem is I have honestly no way of killing that Stratosaur. Oh, shoot. That Stratosaur clicks Magnify, then I lose. Yeah, I lose to Stratosaur. Hmm. Yeah, no, I, I lose to Stratosaur. I'm not, I'm not winning this. I'm not winning this game, but I can try to get Cerebellin to pop off before I lose immediately. Yeah, this makes sense. This always outseeds me, so I'm just going to Barb immediately if I can. I just want to get my Barbs up as quickly as possible. Unless this is Frost Beam, which would be absolutely crazy. Let me see the Frost Beam Gwendolyn right now. Do people even remember that this thing gets Frost Beam? That's the real question. He does go for the fadeaway, though. So he is a uh, generic Wendelin fadeaway spammer, as I was once. Do they go to Eclipse on the potential slap down because they're worried? No, they're going immediately for the win. Okay. Nope, they want to win immediately. I have nothing that outspeeds this. Hey, this is just really bad in general. I lose immediately to this. Unless he, he clicks Airstrike now, then potentially I have a good maybe a chance i'm not i'm not sure i need to do as much as i physically can to the stratosaur before it starts to pop off because if i don't well i am not gonna survive till the end of this battle because i did not bring my ika that i usually bring to kill these things so i'm assuming you just hype it to reach though to just get the kill so oh it actually goes for gust or magnify either one works all right i'm gonna slap because i need damage i like actually require damage with the stratosaur Unless you go into your Colossal Traps now, which, hey, if you do that, I don't really care, because I can just go into Lava. Okay. We got good damage. It's actually Jet Stream. Okay. Uh, let's honestly play the Cerebellin now, because at this point, we do have a really, really strong hit to throw out right now. We can Stampede into a Quick Pounce, which gets the kill. Let's Stampede. I think he's going to struggle to beat this unless he goes for airstrike, which I'd probably get down to like my V in health is what I'm going to think about, which makes sense to me. But he can't really switch because he gets me a completely free typeless hit on something, which he is not capable of tanking very well. 
But I would much rather me get this hit off rather than the Stratosaur survive longer. Yeah, that, that sucks. But something dies here at least. Oh yeah, this is going to explode. I think this gets one shot. No, 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 no. It has good, good melee defense. This is not dying in one hit. Alright, but I get to get the kill with Quick Pounce, which is exactly why we have Quick Pounce, to get this kill in situations like these. Oh, way! We take down the Colossal Drops. That Stratosaur man comes in and it wins the game. Shoot. But, right now my Cerebellum is terrifying, right? He is not capable of dealing with this very well. He's just gonna click Fade away, right? I'm just gonna Stampede again. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Go Stratosaur right now. Valkyrie. This'll do a lot. Sheesh! Cervelin, my man! It's Mega Chomp. I mean, Cervelin's doing all this to pop off, then I just lose to Stratosaur, so... Lashent is my only hope against Stratosaur, so... I'm assuming you just go into Wendelin here. Okay, I get a quick pounce. Actually, I don't even have to quick pounce here. I can actually live a hit. So, I could throw out a Mega Chomp, honestly. Do I do that? I could throw I could throw out Mega Chomp or a quick pounce. I'm going to quick pounce because I get two hits of it rather than just one at Mega Chomp. So, I throw out more damage this way. And I live this hit. It's actually really bad that I live because now they just go Stratosaur and then they win with Magnify. Oh no. Oh no, do not go Stratosaur. Okay, they are terrified of Stratosaur right now for some reason. I'm gonna rest because you're probably gonna palm. Are you gonna palm? Palm right now. Let me rest into another Stampede. Okay. Hey, it was a play I could have made. It would have been really funny to let this thing live. But Cerebellin absolutely popping off against this team until they send Stratosaur and then I lose the game. Huh. Maybe if I quick pounce, I could have gotten Rancidor in, which would have baited the Stratosaur in. And then he goes for the metal move. I don't even know. It's tough, it's tough, it's tough, it's tough, it's tough. There's no point to barb, I just have to driving force, honestly. If it goes Stratosaur, he's just gonna airstrike. If I go Lashent, I can tank it, I can fade away. He goes for a Magnify, he'd be at plus one. I get into Waba. It can tank probably one hit. This is good. This is what we want. To get damage on the Stratosaur before I immediately lose the game. I could probably set up barbs, but... I don't wanna. I'm gonna deep freeze. This could be worth it. It was worth it. Okay. Driving. Stratosaur. Ah, oh, Wendelin, that makes sense. It's fine though. I'm gonna driving force again because I have milkshakes. So even if this play ends up failing, then I know what move he's gonna click, so I can just click deep freeze afterwards and gets the kill. He's just gonna fade away though and just Stratosaur. Yeah. He's kind of a one one mind right now. One mindset of getting shot a sort in to win the game. And as long as I keep it off of the field. I just have to keep it off of the field and get this Demoglio. So all I need to do right now is just get the damage and it is working. Okay. I can luster and it's not really that serious. I am getting the necessary damage. I got the necessary damage I needed. Lashent can easily beat this. I'm just going to Driving Force because at this point, Lashent beats everything. Lashent can beat everything. I'm dead to Metal Blast, but at this point, the damage has been done. Wobba absolutely popped off. I clicked every right move until the very end. I could have clicked Driving Force again and then I would have been completely fine. But Lashent does end up winning this game. It was close, but it's, it's, it's okay. I'm kind of noticing a little bit of a problem here. 
But I just click fade away. And if they go to clips, they go to clips. And then I don't get the effective move. Then I just get to click earthquake. Oh, nice. I got the right move here. I mean, there's going to go Stratosaur on uh, the Rancidor, so. Maybe it's Frail Armor and it's like very smart or something. It's spooky because there isn't Eclipse in the back, right? But he can't switch it in that much. But I beat this Stratosaur every single time, so. If he clicked Magnify, honestly, if he Magnified, like, Magnify, Airstrike, Jetstream, or High Pitch, he could have killed me, honestly. Maybe I'm underestimating Lashent's tankiness, because I am very tanky. Maybe. Maybe. Actually, I do think that probably killed. I'm gonna click Fade Away, though. And if they go into to Eclipse, I get to Earthquake. Okay, game's over. We won. Does this thing have a good range of defense stat? Uh, okay, to clips probably isn't killing me in one hit. It doesn't matter though. Lashent beats the beats the clips. Mostly dark search flinches. But even then, as long as I don't die with Rancidor, we win. Oh no, uh Muck Blast kills anyway. Muck Blast. Boom. Down goes the tick clips. We get our soul siphon, but it doesn't matter because the game is over. Alrighty. Here we go to the next battle. Uh, another scary erupted on fight. Uh, I mean, it's another game where Cerevelin can do absolutely incredible work. Just gotta get it on the field at the right time. I'm gonna bring you. I want to bring this because it's my only switch really into Vesp. I mean, I do kind of have Tyrex. I want to bring uh, Rancidor because I feel like it could be it could prank him. And Nova Blast is just incredibly strong here. He has two resists, one of which is a really bad resist, and it plays around Zulon, so we're gonna need to bring Hollow Bunch. I'm considering Mutagon not a resist. I didn't give a Nova Blast. Ooh, I keep forgetting to do that. Give my Hollow Bunch Nova Blast back. It's all you need to remember. It's not hard. It's 15 more power. The cost like what? 12 energy? Who cares? For me, it'd be like what? Six energy because it's less. Maybe. Because my energy orb. Mutagon. Well, I don't care about this thing in the slightest. I can literally go for a barb into slap into barb barb. If he's frost punch, then I get to barb slap. But if he's uh. If he's Brawn Boost, then it doesn't matter. I'm going to kill this thing anyway. And this thing lost um, Quick Punch, so... And Frost Punch comes out. And Ranch Store comes in. I'm just gonna Spectral because um, it guarantees the kill and I'd rather not risk Muck Blast. I just wanna click those arrows. And we get our Soul Siphon here. If I was Clutch Plushy here, then man, he's in a very bad spot. What? Is this Boots? Is this Boots? Why would he send this in? Why would he send this in to not Boots, right? Why, why would you send this in to not Boots? I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go Hollow Bunch. I do not trust this thing at all. Hypnosis. Well, there goes my Zulong check. Hmm. 
Oh, shoot. It wasn't boots, so maybe the switch was a bad idea. Well, anyway, let's start clicking Barb. And if they go into Eruptodon, well, I will just lose. Okay. They like to click Hypnotize. That's, that's apparent. Well, a lot of my team's asleep. Ah, come on, you crit, too. Surely he misses Hypno here, right? This guy's just the best. I, I, just, I got nothing on him. He's just the best. Uh, I assume we're up to dawn, right? Zulon. Anything to quickly wake up the Tala Bunch so I'm not going to get one shot by everything in the game. I mean, there's a good chance that Servalin can... Servalin no lives one hit, right? So... Ebers comes out, we take absolutely nothing. This will be our first turn of sleep. Ancient Roar. That's fine, because I don't care. Let's see what he does. Ah, Mega Chomp. That would be a clever one. That would be clever. But then I just, I just go, uh, I feel like I just go Rancid, but I'm gonna go Simon because then I get the Milkshake heal. Unless you flash and flee. If I just doubled Rancidor there, I got the kill. That would've been very nice. I'm just gonna start barbing because right now, the more chip I get, the better Cerebellum's gonna pop off late game. What did he click? What? You gave me my Hollow Bunch speed control? That is the most confusing thing that has happened today. He clicked it again? What? Oh, no, I guess I, I, I don't even know what I was thinking there. Kabunga Coffee is carrying him, though. That's for sure. Okay, all my barbs are up. He's going to hypnotize again because it's the only thing he knows how to do. Whenever someone's low. He does hit it. This guy is really good at this game. Can't even lie. Never met a better player than him. really good there's the guard uh, I mean he's not taking it any advantage of the fact that I am asleep right now if he stays in again it's just dumb right like it's, he's just, it's just dumb what he's doing Well, now that I know more about this Cosmure, I know that I can kill it here. And I'm not worried about it. Hmm. Zulong, I assume, just comes in. I wonder, actually, if Cerebellin could actually win the game from here. I don't think I have enough damage at all on the Luminami, but I'm honestly... Oh, never mind. His Zulong is slow. It's Bane of Hate's Zulong, I'm just saying. Well, he's giving me range attack, so does, does Ransor just close out the game? Is he Magma Block? I'm gonna show you that you die here, buddy. Landslide right now. Mudslide, even. Let my mans win. Boom! Ah, oh, look 
look at that. He's terrified. I knew he would do that too. I knew he'd try to magma block. No, mud spatter. Oh god, man. What? Mud spatter? That ain't it, buddy. If I was Ancient Essence, I killed the Erupted on. Bro, what? I don't get it. I want to win with the guy anyway. Just kill me. Just kill me! Not forfeit. Just kill this! So I can go into the guy. Just gonna magma block. Oh shoot! He didn't mindlessly click. Shoot, I did not expect that. I knew this dude was uh, allergic to whenever you send in a something that's not asleep and they have Cosmere. Don't I get burnt if I hit the Eruptodon? I'm gonna bulk up. Did I just throw? Potentially. Yeah, I just threw because I thought that he would magma block. But turns out I'm stupid. Oh, why did I not just attack him? There was no point. I wanted to bulk up and be smart, but... Sometimes being smart isn't the best thing to do. Oh, and you click fire. I'm so confused. Well, now we gotta hope that we kill the Luminami with Cerebellin. You know, that no, that was the plan. You know, he's gonna magma block. I think you have enough for one more. I, I don't understand players that play like this. I, I mean, if I clicked Quick Pounce, I just won the game, right? Like, it, that was my fault. No, it was all coming down to if Cerebellin can actually kill Luminami, but honestly, I don't think it's going to be happening. Well, let's find out. On this episode. Oh no, it's killing, never mind. Maybe. Unless, I could also outspeed it. That'd be hilarious. If I outspeed it, then I know that it's very sluggish. Submerge. Do I die? No, it's awakening because it didn't heal. So yeah, I'm dead to this. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> I just wanted Sir Roland to win. But it turns out that Luminami is kind of dumb. And I, I don't... I don't... I don't, I don't know, I don't get it. I don't know why, 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 why. You know, regardless of what happened, I think Servalon absolutely popped the heck off in some specific fights. I think it was like the first and second one, it did absolutely amazing. And this one, I threw, my fault. And overall, I think Stampede is pretty funny for now until there's an alternative to it. Because, I don't know, I think it's fine to be this incredibly powerful move. I'm, I'm totally not against it with it existing. It's, it's kind of cool. But yeah, hopefully everybody enjoyed, and I'll see everybody in the next one. Bye-bye!